In April 2016, Voyages to Antiquity is offering a 13-day voyage that traces the footsteps of St. Paul across the Aegean and Mediterranean. Follow his journey to sites including Ephesus, Athens and Philippi, where St. Paul established the first church in Europe. This spring cruise also sails to the most beautiful Greek islands including Delos, Patmos and Mykonos. Upon arrival in Greece, you will spend two nights in a quality Athens hotel before joining Aegean Odyssey in the port of Piraeus, following a morning of sightseeing. During your time in the ancient city of Athens, you can enjoy sites including the Parthenon, Acropolis, Mars Hill and the Olympic Stadium. Your first port of call on the voyage is the sacred island of Delos, followed by Mykonos, before arriving in Patmos, where the Apostle John wrote the Book of Revelation. Here you can visit the medieval village of Cora and the monastery of St. John the Theologian, together a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Aegean Odyssey will then depart late evening and set courses for the seaside town of Kusadasi in Turkey, where a tour to Ephesus, the ancient Roman capital where St. Paul lived for three years, is included. Dikili is next on your itinerary, followed by a stop in Kanakali, where an included tour to the UNESCO World Heritage Site of Troy is offered. A scenic Dardanelles ferry crossing will also allow guests to visit Gallipoli from the port of Kanakali, this too being an included tour option. The northern Greek city of Kavala is your seventh port of call and one that offers tours to Philippi a city founded by and named after Philip of Macedonia in 356 BC. Confront antiquity at every turn of its extraordinary archaeological site and in addition visit the stream where St. Paul's first European convert to Christianity was baptised. A full day in Thessalonica is next with a Byzantine Thessalonica tour being highly recommended. Byzantine emperors held Thessalonica, also known as Salonica, second only in importance to Constantinople. And today the city is an open-air museum with Christian monuments dating from the 4th to the 21st century. The famous Byzantine monasteries of Meteora are next via the port of Volos, which is swiftly followed by a call to Skiathos. Enjoy a day at leisure before arriving in your final port of call, Piraeus, where you will disembark Aegean Odyssey for your flight back. <laughs>